Hey, today I decided to pull my racer out that I rebuilt last year. Some may know him as a road bike. Road bike, racing bike, road racing bike, whatever. Anyway, I rescued this from being scrapped. It was painted a lovely luminous yellow and luminous pink. Someone had done a very poor paint job on it. Um, but the reason I rescued it is because I'm only five foot four with short legs, so a standard racing frame is a bit too tall for me. This is the perfect size. Uh, it's got 26 inch wheels, not the usual 27 or 700c size wheels. Uh, and basically all I did was strip it right down to the bare frame, stripped all the old paint off, primed it, resprayed it. Uh, I used the original wheels, just give them a clean up and a, I cheated, I give them a lick of paint as well. There's a slight buckle in the back wheel, but nothing major. Um, I fitted classic Weinman brake calipers. I'm not, I'm not certain if it's pronounced Weinman or Weinman. So I think they're German, which means a W may be pronounced as a V. I don't know. Anyway, it's only got rear gears. I never use front gears on a racer, so I decided to just fit the rear gears. Nice shiny seat post, red handlebar tape. That was brand new that I picked up at a car boot sale. Never been put on a bike. Uh, I do believe I put Weinman brake levers on it as well. Yes. I don't think that's going to show up on the camera, but they are Weinman brake levers. They're not in the best of conditions. But I'm not too fussy. Short mud guards, they're actually plastic, not metal. And they are they're not cut down plastic mud guards, they are actually short mud guards. Yeah. It's got built in pump brackets. I'm not sure how many gears. I can't remember. Hang on. One, two, three, four, five, six. I really do have a poor memory. I'm not sure I like that stem. I may change that one day. It's quite nice to ride. You don't really notice the slight buckle in the back wheel. If I could be bothered to get my stand out, I'd have put it up on the stand to show you, but I stand behind the sofa behind me. And if you're wondering how I scoot around, it's because I'm on a office chair. I've got wheels on my chair because I'm lazy. <laughs> anyway, what crank do I fit on this? It's a rally crank. I'm not actually sure what the brand of this was. There was no stickers or badges on it when I got it, so... Brand... or make, I'm not sure. Uh, I think that's about it. That's all I can say on this, really. I do need to fit some lights to it. I just haven't decided what lights I'm going to fit to it yet. could go for dynamo lights, because there's a bracket on the fork there for the front light. Well, there's the mount to where you put the bracket for the front light. I just noticed I've got a leaf stuck in the back. No, it's not a leaf, there's a bit of rope. That's what people used to do to keep the hubs clean. Tie a bit of rope or put a rubber band or something around the hub. Like clean the hub as it went round. It's a nice little bike. It's one of two racing bikes I've got. I've got a Falcon downstairs in the shed. In fact, I think I've got too many bikes. I just don't like parting with them. Yeah, I don't think there's much else I can say. So, uh, 
I'll end the video here. Thanks for watching. Until next time. Bye.